building just got a whole lot faster with Command Panel. In this video, I'm going to show you how to open up Command Panel, what it can do, and lastly, I'm going to share with you the two new shortcuts that we added to the platform. And as somebody who's in the builder every single day, I am very excited about what these two shortcuts do. Let's dive in and open up Command Panel. To open Command Panel, we're going to press Command K on Mac or Control K on Windows. And that is how we open it up, Command K or Control K. Let's look at what Command Panel does. We can navigate the builder and perform all these actions right in the centralized place. So we can add all of our different components right here. We can switch breakpoints. We can go to different pages. We can even execute the various shortcuts all directly in here. So let's show this off. I'm in my container right now, and I'm gonna do Command K at a box. And I wanna rename this, but I don't remember the shortcut. So I'm gonna do Command K and say Edit Instance Label. And it's gonna remind me that Command E is the shortcut, but I'm just gonna do Enter, call this card. And then let's just add a heading and then a paragraph. Now I want to add a token and I can just switch right over to my uh, open style panel right here, but I don't remember the token. So I'm gonna navigate to my style guide page. I have a lot of pages and I might forget them. So I'm just gonna search pages. And this is gonna show me all my pages and I can even just search from here and go style guide. So the search is very flexible. I'm gonna select my style guide and see that I have this is card highlight here. This is that one I want. Okay, so I'm gonna go back over to my homepage and I actually want to show you one other cool thing we can do with pages. When we are searching within pages, we can have various actions we can perform. And as shown here, we can press tab. Normally, you're going to select whatever it is, but some things have these secondary actions like pages. So I could arrow down and go to settings. So right here, I can go directly to the pages settings using command panel. Okay, and I just added the two tokens I wanted to to this instance. So Command Panel lets you navigate around in the builder. I can change breakpoints, drop over to my mobile one. I can navigate pages. I can open my settings panel. So you can really just get around with the Command Panel. That is the gist of it. However, I want to show you two new shortcuts we've added to the command panel. And by the way, there's going to be a lot more that gets added to the command panel over time. Um, but right now, let's say I have this heading and I want to add a paragraph below it. Well, the old way of doing it is adding the paragraph, then going up to the container, adding a box, dragging the box over here, and then dragging both of these into the box. Now that's a lot of steps. Let's revert that by first showing one of the keyboard shortcuts, which is unwrap. So I can do unwrap, which is going to take this box, bring the child contents out of it and get rid of the box. This is super handy. Now, if I were going to add the box uh, the new way, I am going to go to my heading and then do wrap in box or wrap in link. So sometimes you realize, oh, actually, I want this to be wrapped in a link instead of a box. You could do that. But we're going to wrap it in a box. And now I could add a paragraph. And there we go. Just with like two actions, I was able to perform the same thing I was doing before with, I don't know, that was probably six different actions. Command Panel is this amazing centralized place to do all these different things you do in the builder. And it's only going to get better over time as we add more shortcuts and commands. Well, we hope you enjoy Command Panel. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.